My hair is important to me because it is evidence of my ancestry and lineage, evidence of the hair that my mother had, my grandmother had. It's a statement, it's who I am. It is professional, it's stylish, it's me. There's no way that you can tell me I didn't get this done at a salon. Hey you guys! Today we are going to be straightening our hair again. I'm going to be posting my updated silk press, hair straightening routine, whatever you want to call it. You know what, let me switch it up a little bit. I currently have no product in it. I have deep conditioned my hair, I have shampooed my hair. I'm going to insert some clips of pretty much what I did. I have shampooed my hair twice with this Old Plex number no. 4 bond maintenance shampoo. And then I came through with a deep conditioner that I use by Briogeo. I'm out of breath. I didn't know So after shampooing with all the blacks number four, I came through with the Briogeo Don't Despair Depair Hair Mask. I let this sit in my hair for about an hour. And to make sure that I fully got the deep conditioner out of my hair, I came through with the Olaplex number four bond maintenance shampoo again to make sure that we got all of this out. I need to make sure that my hair is squeaky clean. When you're straightening your hair, you want to make sure that your hair is completely clean. Of oils, conditioner, I want it all out. The purpose of me deep conditioning was just to give my hair some type of conditioning treatment as I'm about to put it through this heat. So now we are here with squeaky clean hair. Go ahead and section the hair into fours because we always work in sections for the best outcome. I'm gonna part it through the middle. Got our one little piece here. My hair has dried a little bit. I'm going to re-wet it just to make sure that I follow the instructions on the products that we're using. With my spray bottle of water. So first product we're gonna use after I just detangled is Rakimra Blow Dry Lotion. So this pretty much helps with manageability, smoothness of the hair, helps prevent frizz. This is how much I'm gonna use on this section. Not too much. I don't want to add too much product to my hair. I do not want it to weigh it down. My hair feels so soft. <laughs> Alright, so followed by that with the Kendra Blow Dry Spray. So even though we're already working in sections, we're going to turn this section into a section just to make it easier. Because I want to make sure that I thoroughly blow dry all of my hair. Working in this tiny part, I'm going to come through with our blow drying. I'm using the Volumizing Airbrush by EAP Heat. This makes it so much easier. If you follow me on Instagram and TikTok, then you know that I've used this quite a few times. I swear by this. You know what, let me put on a white shirt so it's a little easier to see. Hold on. Look! Only from this. Child, that's how you know it's gonna be a good soap press. When the blowout process looks this good, that's just how you know that you about to have a good outcome. Uh, let's keep going. All right, so now I have finished my hair. This is what we're looking like. <gasps> Look at the yeah, duh time to go through and fully silk press the hair. But I don't have everything I thought, so give me a second. Now I'm about to pretty much flip this hair over so I can get to straightening. Yeah. Straightening, 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 yeah. Yeah, so I don't know why I do it like this. This is just the way that I do it. And then get me one of these type of combs. I'm gonna use this for the chase method. Mm -hmm. Just wrap that motherfucker around. The flat iron I use is EAP Heat Graphite Rose Gold Titanium Flat Iron. This is their one inch flat iron. As far as my heat settings, I only keep it on 390. I do not go over that and I do one pass. So the final product, this Chi Silk Infusion, it just gives the perfect silky skin. I really just use a little bit, like literally that much on this one section back here. All right. Already with a small section. As far as the roots, I do like to just press it. I leave it on my roots maybe for like two seconds. Oh. See, this is why the chase method doesn't work for me. Like, it just don't. But I like to go slow. 
So I do not have to do multiple passes. I don't let it sit in one spot. I just slowly pull my hair away and then let the hair fall out. It's perfect. All right, so y'all saw me do it. Let's go. Let's, let's finish the rest. This is how we look. Off of one pass. Are you kidding me right now? Look at this. It's just like the way it's moving. Oh my gosh. I'm stunned, truthfully. So I'm done. I'm not even gonna lie. But look, you said. Did that shit like what? Like what? DJ Ryan. Oh my gosh! The quality. There's no way that you can tell me that I didn't get this done at a salon. But I just did it. I'm going to trim it later tonight. I'm gonna have my man help me. Pretty much what I'm gonna have him do. So pretty much he'll be evening out the bottom. So you try to play me, but I was so 